Welcome, stage three, possibly here, five to Caroline Chisholm, part one. Uh, Caroline Chisholm is this lovely young lady here on the $5 note, a very important part of Australia's history. Okay, let's learn about Caroline Chisholm and why she's important to Australia. Okay, Carolyn Chisholm was known as the immigrant friend, and an immigrant is someone who has come from overseas who have left one country to go to another country. Now, she was uh, she earned the title for her work with poor immigrants uh, uh, who came to Australia in the last century, and we're talking about the 1800s period. So she was one of this country's most outstanding women, and her port was on this, uh, the $5 note, for more than 20 years. She was born in England in 1808. Okay, so when uh, Caroline Chisholm was 22 years old, 22 years old, she married a gentleman named Archibald Chisholm, who was actually an officer uh, in the army, and they actually decided to move to Australia. Early in their married life, they decided to move to Australia because there was many new opportunities in Australia. It was a new country, there was new things to do. People thought they could make a bit of money in Australia and have a better life, so they moved down to Australia. They got on a big boat and came to Australia. When they sailed into Sydney, it was still a convict town, so it looked like this. It didn't look like like Sydney does today, it was very old fashioned and it was um, uh, it looked quite different <laughs> to it uh, does today. Now, unlike our other army wives, Carolyn didn't stay at home. She didn't stay at home. She actually took walks around Sydney and she was quite shocked at what uh, uh, she uh, saw. There was many women living on the streets uh, and he said they'd been forced to travel out on uh, filthy, overcrowded ships and they'd come to Australia looking for a better life. And this is, of course, uh, when they left England looking, looking to go to Australia uh, for a, a better life. But the problem was when they got to Sydney, when they got to Sydney, there were no jobs or places to live. Um, so consequently, they often took to the streets and they had to survive and you know, do all sorts of horrible things just to forge an existence living on the streets. So what Caroline Chisholm did for them was, was started a home for unemployed uh, homeless women and she found them jobs and she found them jobs like nurses or in baker shops or in shoe shops or all, all sorts of uh, a range of, of, of employment. Uh, so this is the first, uh, this is part one, the, the video that I want you to know and understand all about Caroline Chisholm. I want you to take these notes down in your books. Thank you very much. You can rewind me and go through those notes. And I do want you to draw a picture about something that has struck you uh, underneath those notes that you have taken uh, underneath the various headings that we've looked at so far. Okay, thanks for listening.